Jim Bob. I really wanted to do this before your birthday and before our anniversary, but you pleasantly surprised me with a special anniversary trip to the island of Kauai. So now I'm finally getting around to doing this video for you. But I really, really, really wanted to express from my heart how grateful I am for you and how much I love and admire you. So I'm going to read what I wrote out uh, a while back, but I'm just now finally getting to video this for you. My dearest Jim Bob, I want to wish you happy birthday and happy anniversary. I'll never forget over 34 years ago when we met. At age 16, I was working at the yogurt shop that your mother managed. You came to the counter where I was standing by the cash register and introduced yourself. You were shy, but very sweet. I really don't remember much about that conversation except that you finally mustered up the courage to ask me if I would go to your junior senior banquet with you. I said yes, and I'm so thankful I did. I don't think either one of us ate much of our dinner that evening. We came back to my parents' living room and we sat and talked for four hours about the things of God. You opened up the Bible and you shared truth with me from God's word. I remember when you left that evening, I prayed, Father, I have never met a man like this before. If this is not the one you have for me, I can't imagine anything better. I felt that that day that God had knit our hearts together. It seems impossible to express my love for you in just mere words. I am so grateful to be your wife and here are some of the things that I absolutely love about you. You are a wonderful husband, number one. Number two, you're my best friend. Number three, you're a great dad. Number four, you attempt to fix the things on my honey-do list. Number five, you listen to me. You make me feel loved. Number six, you are my man. Number seven, you are my protector. Number eight, you're awesome. Number nine, you work hard. Number 10, you're an excellent provider. Number 11, you're a gentleman. You make me feel like a lady. Number 12, you have common sense. Number 13, you're kind. Number 14, you know how to make me laugh. Number 15, you have a fun sense of humor. Number 17, you take me on dates. Number, I may have gotten lost in my numbers. You think of me often before thinking of yourself. Number 18, you're so considerate. Number 19, you share your heart with me. Number 20, you're a great leader. 21, you're a godly man. 22, you lead our family. 23, you're the first person I turn to. It means so much that you pray with me. 24, you fear and honor the Lord. 25, you are a visionary person. 26, you come up with fun and exciting ideas. 27, you are steady and stable. You make me feel secure. 28, you can make some awesome hamburgers and hot dogs on the grill. 29, you help around the house. 30, you are fun to work with. 31, you are one handsome man. 32, you are unselfish. 33, you have taught me so much. 34, you encourage me to draw closer to Jesus. 35, you are slow to anger. 36, you are my favorite person in the entire world. 37, you are fun to grow old with. 38, you're a great kisser. 39, you have good judgment. 40, you are very forgiving. 41, you affirm me, that means the world to me. 42, you are a thoughtful man. 43, you care how I feel. 44, you show me respect. 45, when something breaks, you try to learn how to fix it. 46, you inspire me to be the best I can be. 47, when hard times come, you draw strength from God. 48, you stand for the truth. I admire that. 49, your enthusiasm gets me excited. 50, you're a man of conviction. 51, 
you're a man of integrity. 52, you're a man of action. 53, you admit when you're wrong. 54, you have a learning spirit. 55, you read the Bible with me and the kids. 56, you take us to church. 57, you encourage me by your example to show Christ's love to others. 58, you honor your father and your mother. 59, you are a faithful husband and father. 60, you're my dream come true. 61, you are an excellent role model. 62, you humble yourself before God and others. 63, you are willing to learn from your critics. 64, you are an honest man. 65, you genuinely care about others. 66, you have a ministry mindset looking for opportunities to encourage others to turn to God. 67, you comfort me and our kids when we cry. 68, you watch over us when we're sick. 69, you buy us cases of dill pickles even though you don't like to eat them yourself. 70, you're a good sport. 71, you are generous. 72, you give wise counsel after much prayer. 73, you spend time in prayer for me and our children. 74, you are a grateful man. 75, you honored my mother and my father. 76, you take me shopping. 77, you take us on fun outings and vacations. 78, you love my extended family. 79, you play with our kids. 80, you have cleaned up after me and our kids when we are sick with tender compassion. 81, you have allowed and encouraged us to have pets. 82, you have taken care of many unseen details without complaining. 83, you are great at multitasking. 84, you take interest in the things that are important to me and the kids. 85, you have taught me and the kids many important life skills. 86, you're not a quitter. 87, you have encouraged our kids to be entrepreneurs. 88, you have bought and changed hundreds of our baby's diapers. 89, you have helped us learn from our mistakes or bad choices. 90, you are always available for late night talks. 91, you give consequences when needed with compassion. 92, you bear others' burdens. 93, you pray for others' needs and trials. 94, you lead us in prayer for our leaders. 95, you honor our veterans and their families. 96, you are thankful to live in America and you don't take for granted our freedoms. 97, you taught our children to say, thank you, mama, for having me on their birthdays. 98, you wear cologne just for me. 99, you call me my love. And 100, you still make my heart flutter when you greet me with a hug and a kiss at the end of the day. Our kids are blessed that you are their dad. I respect you so much. I wouldn't trade my life with you for anything. It's an honor to be Mrs. Jim Bob Duggar. I love being by your side. I just love being with you. I love you, Jim Bob, from your shell.